right, drawing an obtuse angle this time, so that means our angle is going to be between 90 and 180 degrees. Um, again, only drawing any kind of constructions or drawings with angles, we want to make sure we've got a nice sharp pencil and a protractor where we can see all the points and it is um, clear with all the numbers and again a ruler where you can see all the numbers and all the little marks are clear as well. So we're going to start off with a straight line. The length of the straight line does not really matter. I'm going to do, uh, let's do my nine centimeters. Okay, so we're going to do a 117 degree angle on one of these ends of this line. So it's up to you. Um, I think I'm going to do it on this side here. So I'm going to take my protractor. I'm going to make sure that this line along the base is in line with this and that where this cross is at the bottom of the protractor is in line with this vertex uh, or end of the line, which will end up being a vertex. Okay, so I'm going to line that up as best as we can. Okay, now our angle is going to be coming from this line, so we want to make sure the zero is what we're starting from. We're going to get up to 117. So we go all the way around. Here's 110 and 120. So it's going to be between these two. That would be 115, 120. So it's going to be between them two. So the little nodule, no, uh, little marks is going to be 115. 16, 17, do a little mark, pull your protractor away, get your ruler out, and then we're going to join that up like so. So this angle here should be 117. Okay, so I've taken everything away. Let's do a little measure to check how accurate I am. Seven, so one, one, four. 115, 16, 17, I'm happy with that, okay? So again, make sure once you've measured it and you've drawn it, take everything away and then measure it again. 